Hello and welcome to a new video about my Barbecue controller. Last time we did a little programming of our of our display. This was working. I, I tweaked it a little bit already, uh, but uh, it, it's now looking like that. Uh, it's now looking like that. Uh, maybe turn off this. Uh, see, it's displaying now the values below yeah, 24 and so on uh, looking pretty nice i must say this this is red this is really red this is darker these are darker colors because there is no value so i can see if a probe is plugged in or not and here in this upper area i want to display the trend okay so i have a trend which i want to display and this brought me to an idea i want to produce an object I want to produce an object that will allow me to add lines, to add data, a data uh, column, data follow, a data string, huh? new value, uh, value one, new value, value two, new value, value three, new value, and so on. And this object should handle. Uh, the different data streams, the different data uh, rows. Now I found the word row would be appropriate. Uh, uh, the different data row, rows. And if I ask, it should tell me the coordinates why I should draw, where I should draw a line. Good. Uh, so I want to have a data row. Mm -hmm. How to do this? Yeah. I am producing an object data row. This is the object, okay? The class name. Yeah. It will have a, a hmm. We'll have add new row, add new row, whatever this, this means now, yeah. Uh, then uh, I will, I will remove, remove row, then I will have Add value. Mm -hmm. Then I will have uh, clean values. Add value means I have a new value. Yeah? I will add this to this value to this to this data row. Add a new value. Then clean values means I want to give a window, uh, which is the allowed value, yeah? so if, if we think about, yeah? here we have x and y. x and y. This is the area where I want to plot. Yeah? Then this x has a certain region. Min x, max x. And I want to give this region and whatever is outside of this region, the, the clean values should remove from this data row. Yeah. Good. Add value will add a new x and y value. All right. Uh, okay, and then we will have a uh, get value. Get value. So I want to have the next value of this data row. Okay. Then these these are these are uh, data row the methods. Then we have uh, properties.
properties. What uh, do we have here? Previous row, data row pointer, previous, a pointer to the previous row, data row pointer, data to the next. Uh, this might be null or something, a, a pointer to the data row. Then we have data points first. Uh, the first data point of this data row. So I will also have I will also have here Where is my light blue pen? Lost it. I don't like when things get lost. It was just lying on the table somewhere. I always use it, the light blue pen, because I have so many of them. So I'll grab one. <laughs> ah. Here it is, here it is. I have to take the point. Methods. Add value. Adding a new, adding a new value, then we have clean value. We have get value. Mm -hmm. Then we have properties. Data point. I will only only remember the next one. So here is the entry point. Next, 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 next. Yeah. Good. I wonder if I can do it like that. I oh, will see when I'm when I'm coding it. Huh? Get value index. Properties. And value. Yeah. Int. Or long. While x. Int. While y. The value. All right, data row containing a lot of data points. I can add rows. I can add values. I can clean values. This is my point of entry, and then I will have one object called chart, or or plot, or chart. I call it chart methods. Add new row, remove row, add value, clean value, get value. No, I don't need to get value. Or, or, get value, we'll see, then set x resolution, how many points we have here, set y resolution, 
how many points we have here. Set x uh, meanwhile. What is the menu value here? And set x with how many do I have here? So if I have here, meanwhile, let's say r I don't know, 12 seconds, and this should represent 180 seconds. Then this is the meanwhile and, and width. Okay? And the same here. Let's say we, we have here, I don't know, uh, set y minimum value. Let's say we have here, I don't know, minimum value 60 degree, and set y width. Uh, this should represent uh, 100 degree. Hmm? So with, with resolution and the min and width value, I can set uh, how many how many degree or seconds per pixel I have. Hmm? I think that's it. And the properties are data row, the first data row, x and y resolution, x and y width, and that's it. This I want to have here programmed. And then I only can ask, I only ask, give me the next point, give me the next get value or get, get coordinates, maybe or get coordinates, I don't know how to call this. Then I can draw a line, get coordinate, tuck, 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 and I can draw a line. It will tell me x and y uh, coordinates uh, according to resolution. And I can draw a line, get coordinate of next value of, of, of data row 1, data row 2, data row 3, and so on. This is uh, how I think this should work. Mm -hmm. Now we'll start to program this. I start with the data point, of course. Next video, next video. This is the plan. Next video, execute the plan. For this time, thank you very much for listening. Goodbye.